I have a wild story about my mom being misdiagnosed. A few years back, she developed this issue where she was always in pain and would randomly pass out. It happened a couple times where she fell face down and bashed her face, <laughs> giving her you. giving herself black eyes. It's giving you. It is it, giving Harper. It, this is literally what Harper does. What? How? Because you have epilepsy and you fucking fall over all the time. All the time. The thing about doing a podcast <laughs> with two fucking liars is that it's really hard to like stand uh, up for myself. What is it called? The co- the pot calling the kettle black. It, it, that's a little racist, but yeah. <laughs> is it? <laughs> no. I don't so it's know. very fitting coming from Gabby. Okay. Hey, Hunks and Lee. I, I have like a wild that story I'm, about my. I don't like that. I'm I have a wild a story about my mom being misdiagnosed. <laughs> a few years back, she developed this issue where she was in pain and would randomly pass out. It happened a couple times where she fell face down and bashed her face. Okay, Gabby, I'm gonna literally chop your foot off and stick it up your fucking hemorrhoid ass <laughs> if you fucking annoy the fuck out of me one more fucking time. Okay. Okay. Not not. <laughs> <laughs> You laugh like you have jelly beans in your tummy. I'm getting fucking pissed. I'm just okay. excited to see Bad Bunny tonight. Okay, yeah, fuck off. Okay, oh, I'm going to literally bash your knees so you can't go. Okay, um, would pass out. It happened a couple times where she fell face down and bashed her face. Wait, giving herself black eyes. It was super scary. She went to this dude, Gyno, which also, okay, I don't think you should be fucking looking. I don't I don't think women should be looking at dicks for, as a doctor. I don't think men should be looking at pussies for a doctor. I, don't I agree. Them. I agree I with that. I think that's just, I don't, I don't understand. We don't get it. We don't get the anatomy. <laughs> Even as, as, as scientific as you can be, a guy gets what it's like having a dick. A woman gets what it's like having a pussy. Yeah, and also like the emotionally, like vo- the, the emotional vulnerability it takes to like fucking show someone you're fucking snatched. Like, yeah. come on. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I had a fucking, okay, when I got my first IUD in, he was asking me if I did stand up while he was in, he's like, oh, so you do stand up? Tell me a joke. Boom, boom. And like shoving a fucking IUD up here. I'm like, okay. And he's like, that's not funny. Give me another yeah, one. Come on. Ha, 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 ha. And I'm like, yeah. oh my God. Yeah. I'm like give throwing the, up blood on the ground. Give okay. me the yuck yucks, bitch. Okay. Which as a man, I think <laughs> gyne- gynecologists are gross. Sorry. Okay. Amen. He told her some wild shit about how if she didn't get this surgery, her vagina would fall out. Oh, <laughs> that sounds actually that sounds like true. Lee. Honestly, Lee is always coming up with some whack ass shit to say, like take some medicine. OK, um, other doctors said that she was just under stress or just experiencing anxiety. No one listened to her or thought it was alarming. She would pass out and bash her face in randomly. Oh, easy. Yeah. Um, she eventually got some advice on what tests would to request from my girlfriend's mom at the time. Now, my mother in law, who was a cancer nurse. Oh, my, who's my now mother-in-law, who's a cancer nurse. They found out she had a cyst on one of her ovaries that she had removed and recovered, but is doing well. But during the time frame when she was passing out and didn't know what was wrong, when I lived at home, I got super sick one night. It was a stomach bug I got from my girlfriend's family. I woke up to puke. And as I was barfing, my mom came downstairs to check on me. And I was like, I'm fine. Go back to bed. Mid barf. I heard a heavy thud. And once I finished, I looked Aww. over to see my mom out cold with her head in the dog's water dish. Mm. Oh, Lee, why would you laugh at that, you sociopathic mess? It's, not funny. it's funny. It's not funny. The, what, the dog's water dish? It's not funny. So funny. Lee, it's not funny. I'm... Okay, we Fuck need to have... you. It's not funny. Uh, Gabby, you're a sociopath too, but at least you're on board with this. I mean, I, I swear to God, Lee, the <laughs> emotional depth, where is it? Where is it, babes? Okay, and this is why we had to break up. Okay. <laughs> and water dish, come on. It's not funny. <laughs> Okay, you're actually being funny. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Lee, try and compose yourself because I have to read some more trauma. So try not to laugh at women's pain. Okay. Um, <laughs> bitch, where even am I? It's all bleeding. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, this is all because of a cyst? Yes. But not not cancerous. No. Just a cyst that's making her pass out. Yeah. That's what we th- are told. Okay. Yes. Um, Mid barf, heavy thud. Okay, earmuffs, Lee. She fell in the dog's water dish. All right. Uh, I rolled her. She put that in to be funny. Oh, shut. Okay, shut the fuck up. Well, keep reading. She didn't put this. She's not putting she punches the in this. Dish. She's no, not she like. water dishes to be funny. <laughs> Lee, you are some sort of sick fucking bastard. Keep reading. If you I think... can't. I don't even want to look at You know what? Right I now. can't. I can't. I, I literally. <laughs> yeah, keep reading. Don't. Don't breathe into the mic like that okay gabby let's just lock in because i fucking can't with this okay to see my mom out cold with her head in the dog's water dish i rolled her over and her eyes were wild uh wild and she was shivering i didn't even get a chance to rinse the barf out of my mouth she came to after a minute or two and she said she was okay and i and said just go to bed she went upstairs and i started to clean myself up while i was rinsing out my mouth i heard another loud thud from her bedroom upstairs 
Lee. I ran up to see my mom on her bedroom floor, laying on her back with no shirt or bra on, shaking with her eyes wide open, darting around like someone in REM sleep. Jesus. Okay, that sounds like a seizure. Yeah, and grunting like it was hard to breathe. It was truly exhausting. Or sorry, it was truly haunting um, exorcist type shit. I shook her by the shoulders and said, mom, over and over for what seemed like forever, but was only probably a minute or two. When she woke up, I helped her sit up and she looked all confused. After a couple seconds, she began to understand what happened. She went upstairs and was changing out of her shirt that was wet from the dog's water dish and passed out on the way to grab a new shirt. She said she was okay and I made sure she got into bed, then went back downstairs to barf some more. For the rest of the night and the next day, I threw up pretty much every hour. It was terrible. But it was super. It would be super cool if you guys read this. Love the podcast. My wife and I listen to it. I'll attach some pictures of us. We've been together nine years and married for one. Us Aww. in high school. Us with my mom around the time she was sick. Us for our wedding day and the more recent one of my little sister. Oh, they just sent us pictures. Just yeah, to see. there was cute. no, there was no resolution there. There was no resolution. They, but you did, guys are very cute. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I'm. I got so confused because this was an acid trip reading this story because I had to yell at these fucking hogs the whole time. She 100 put the dog bowl to be funny. <laughs> she didn't put the dog bowl to be funny. Uh, t- two. So your mom had a dial. Mom- call nine one one if she's passing out that much. But okay, so okay, hold on. Yeah, so she, the mom. All all we know is that it's just a benign tumor. I've, my mom being misdiagnosed. A few years back, she developed an issue where she was always in pain and would randomly pass out. And it was a it was a cyst. Oh it was God. a ovarian cyst. Yeah, this sounds like a. It, there's a lot of information missing, and what happened? Not, okay, not, not you getting mad. Yeah, not, not you getting fucking mad. We don't need the fucking attitude. I'll tell you that we don't need the fucking but attitude. He's so, so mad. You can fucking calm the fuck down. You want to know what he's Call mad because he's like nobody. He's really mad because nobody ended up jerking off. Into oh, yeah. that water bowl. No, no, you know he's, he's mad. He's, mad he's like, it wasn't water in the dog's bowl. It was cum. Lee, how many times are we going to use the same fucking cum punchline? Sorry. No, there was actually water in the dish. It's not a whodunit situation. Well, we know it was the, the dog's thing. water. No, 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 because now you're fucking stuttering and blubbering, and I'm going to get fucking no, okay, even everybody more just shut the fuck up. No, you shut the fuck up because now I'm going the fuck off on you. No. And why was that fucking funny? Shh, shh. <laughs> Why didn't she call nine one one? And if their mo- that is mother a good was question. like, well, here dying. I will tell you guys for when you're pat. Well, for if you have epilepsy and you're passing out like that, but there's nothing. Diagnosed epilepsy, there's nothing right? really. Well, I'm saying like if you're like passing out, it sounds like that was a fucking seizure with her eyes fluttering like that. Yeah, it sounded it, like she was having repetitive seizures. Yeah, and she but there's to be nothing. Hospitalized. She should get like a she, brain you scan. should go to the doctor. Yeah. But like yeah. uh, just like if. If your seizure lasts more than like a minute, then you should go to the hospital a hundred percent because you can get like you can permanently like fuck it your brain. It sounds like up. she wasn't stopping; like she was kind of coming to, but not really. She was still confused. Now, what I ta- and I'm then taking she was away going down again. Hold on, what I'm taking away from this story is a beautiful moment between a mother and a daughter. While a mother is passing out, and the daughter's and the daughter's throwing, throwing up. up. And- and, I hear, and in the end, everybody's okay. And I hear all of the complaints, and I and I yeah, I hear a beautiful story, and yeah. I hear your complaints. My one, and you guys, you know, you're, yeah. you sent us all these pictures. Here's the one picture you didn't include: a picture of your mom's tits. That's the <laughs> one question. How fuck? Yeah, 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 yeah. How yeah. were those floppies? Yeah, Gab. Yeah. All right, next story. Okay. 